to fly to Washington, D.C. We just boarded the plane and we're ready to take off for D.C. Zimbabwe. Montenegro, baby. Embassy, Embassy of, of the Sultanate, Sultanate of Oman. The Embassy of Brazil. Here we are at the National Archives of the United States of America. We're about to go in and see with our own eyes the original documents of our nation. The Declaration of Independence, the Bill of Rights. Constitution of the United States They're of America. The it's so exciting to be here in real life. It is. Here we are at the White House of the United States of America where our president lives. Okay, what do you think about being at the White House? I like it. We're going to the Washington Monument. I had to get a time ticket like 60 days ago at 10 a.m. And I am so excited. Been to DC, this is my fourth time, but I never got to go in it. but it's my first time to actually go in the monument. There's the Lincoln Memorial from the perspective of the Washington Monument. And there's the capital of the United States of America, <laughs> right here in Washington, D.C. That's the capital of the United States of America, right there. We just came back down the elevator from way up there. It was an amazing view, 40 degrees of visibility, 40 miles of visibility. Hey, we are having so much fun scootering around at the Capitol. Look at that. Nice. We're at L'Enfant Metro stop. We get off the metro and there's these food trucks. I love that they just pull these food trucks up right at the time you need to eat. It's cheaper and it saves time in lines at restaurants. Tickets are free, but you have to wait in this really long line. And I had to sign in on the day of at 8.30 exactly to get a time at one o'clock. Here goes Luke, he's going to find Neil Armstrong's actual astronaut outfit. Wow, there's Neil Armstrong's actual astronaut uniform. Luke just did a speech on this, and now we get to see the actual one. This is the closest I've been to something on the moon. This is as close as I'm getting from touching the moon. This is the real Wright Brothers airplane. The actual one they, the Wright Brothers flew in 1903. This is one of five bicycles made by the Wright Brothers. All right, here's me and the Wright Brothers. Here we are at the Lincoln Memorial. Washington, D.C. It's a beautiful evening. The weather is perfect.
Library of Congress, and there's the Gutenberg Bible. <laughs> That's so exciting. This is one of the few places in the world with a full, complete copy. There's only three complete copies of the Gutenberg Bible in the world here at the Library of Congress in Washington, D.C., and in Paris, and there's also one in Britain. Okay, how many books are in the Library of Congress? 160 million. 160 million? That's a lot of books. This is Thomas Jefferson's library from 1815. Wow! capital of the United States, right in the center of the dome. Wow, oh, we're on a tour, it's free. All right, we just finished our tour of the capital of the United States. What an amazing story about this building and how they planned the city. of the U.S. government, the Supreme Court. This is the highest court in the United States of America. Library of Congress, where we originally entered from underground and that actually worked the best because we skipped the huge bus of people on the tour. Here we are in the Arlington Cemetery where the soldiers who gave their lives for our freedom are buried. It is requested that everyone remain silent and standing. a day, 365 days a year since 1954. 